Alright people, welcome back to some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's Play, some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Tag Force 5. So, I walked around for a little bit, went to the different locations looking for main character cats, and I came across Leo. So I know someone commented and said they wanted me to duel against Leo, that they wanted to see, uh, I believe it was that Life Dragon, but I'm not sure if he'll get given a chance to summon it. Um, I want to talk to you, and I want to ask about people of interest, so hopefully you can tell me, so... Alright, these are the people that you want to know more about, so hopefully they'll appear on my map. Um, it told me, the game told me that I could probably see Crow in the sect area. Uh, so I came here in the sect area, I'm blue and junk market, and I sang Karma Cops for Leo, so fuck it, you know? Uh, let's do it against Leo. So, um, anyway, I hope that you guys are enjoying the content. I know the channel is simple right now. I guess I'm um, talking, um, I can give you guys a little bit of update. So, League is still on the hold indefinitely it's getting there it's getting there it should be sometime this month sometime in may leaks should start up because i got the majority of the duels in round two there's just some people who are still flaking it some people who are just not getting on it so you know i got cracked on the whip stanzi should be coming back so that should be getting started soon which means that we can probably hopefully put uh, legacy on hold and you'll be getting weekend content of league because that's really what i was planning on the weekend content to be um outside of that league um, I mean, outside of that legacy, uh, we're getting to the end of the Yu-Gi-Oh arc, but there's plenty of DLC that we can purchase, so that can still go on indefinitely, so. Oh my god, this definitely is the first turn, uh, going first hand, but hey, um, uh, Leo decided to go first, so. I mean, why not? Advantage, right? So, I wonder if he's playing, actually playing more Tronics, or what? I'm not sure. We'll find out. Uh, we will find out, so. Uh, I got but ton of back row, holy crap. So I guess I'll just summon Garros and attack, you know? Because why the hell not? So, why that? Why, why now? Oh, yep, definitely more Tronics. I'll we'll figure out what cards I want to set. So, I don't want, of course, I don't want to get Heavy Storm. So, right now, I'm thinking of setting two cards. So, if I can only set two cards, I'm going to set Skill Drink just in case he activates a lot of monster effects. And I'm going to set. Uh, I'm thinking bottomless, but Mirror Force might be good too. I'm gonna set Mirror Force. I'm gonna set two. Because if he has Heavy Storm, then he has to play the Heavy Storm, bluff his own card. So, two for my two. So we even out. You know, you don't want him to plus off of the Heavy Storm if he has it. Because, of course, Heavy Storm is legal. There it is. <laughs> there it is. Did I not call that? You know, I'm sitting here strategizing just in case he had Heavy Storm. So he had it. Blow my shit up. Alright, so we even out. You know, that's the, that's, you know, that's the uh, worst I could act. I mean, that's the best I could expect for when it comes to him. Come on, see, if I would have said everything, I would have got blown the fuck away. So instead, ah, I played it smart. And now, I believe Heavy Storm is only at one, so I don't have to worry about Heavy Storm anymore. Huh? I didn't get me a Heavy Storm. Shit. <laughs> I need to pull it. So, it doesn't look like he's really doing too much. Just kind of setting more Tronics, which I guess is not terrible, but still. So, now I can kind of... Said everything. I don't have to worry about it. Now, if Heavy Storm got multiples in this game, then I'm, I'm, you know, I'm turning the game off right now because fuck that, you know. Heavy Storm should be banned, but I'm fucking at multiple, so. So you're just gonna sit there and go on the defensive. Uh, I believe the deck is still half and half. It's still, you know, uh, 20 spells and traps and 20 monsters. So I'm just not drawing any monsters right now. Yeah, I'm just not drawing. Right, and of course, I always draw the pot of Everest when I don't draw any monsters. Always. So, let's go ahead and kill another Mortronic. Like, Leo, like... I know Mortronics are a very combo-heavy centric deck, but... You know, you need to get the ball rolling, my boy. You need to get the ball rolling, because you are getting wrecked right now. Oh, now he's not even setting any monsters. He's like, I'll just take it on the chin. Alright. Wow, still no monsters. So... 19 out of my 31 cards left in my deck are monsters, because I've only draw, drawn one monster this entire duel. So, I'll just start poking you with Gera. Who's 18 more years from Lime Ring, 18.50, and I guess he does pair well with, uh, with Lila. Not really. Because, like, for every, was it, like, nice one monster you mill with the effect. Unless I have Lila, have Garros, Lila mills three, then if I mill more, a light one, then Garros will draw me. It's probably not going to happen, but, hey, there it is. There's another monster. So, you got any back row for me, Leo, my boy? Or am I just gonna poke the shit out of you? Nope, he's just gonna take it. Damn, Leo! Someone wanted. I think someone wanted me to duel Leo, but I don't think anybody wanted me to be Leo's tag partner. Because obviously, I mean, come on, you know? 
And he's like the made up, uh, six signer. Actually, you know what? No, Leo's actually not the made up six signer. Actually, the fun fact actually, Crow is the made up six signer. Crow wasn't supposed to be a signer, he wasn't, you know, originally, Crow was not supposed to be a signer. Um, now I'm not sure about Leo either because there wasn't supposed to be six signers. They they made Crow. Uh, a signer because Crow's probably already black wings and all that, but he wasn't supposed to be a signer. And I believe, um, what's his name? The, the Infirmary guy, Cal Callum or whatever his name is. I believe he was supposed to be a, uh, a signer. Uh, his, uh, what's it called? The, the Void Over was supposed to be uh, a signer dragon. But hey, hey, they changed the show around. Still, of course, one of the best uh, Yu Gi Oh! series. In my opinion, I, I definitely had these in my favorite. And A, A is in, um, well, by the time this, uh, this episode goes up, I believe Reigns should have already started in Japanese, so I definitely checked that out. I watched all of, uh, let's see, I watched all of, uh, GX, I watched all of, uh, uh, Zexel. I've never finished the original Yu Gi Oh! Not Zexel, not all Zexel. Arc V. I've never, I've never finished Zexel. Who the fuck finished Zexel? <laughs> That's rude. Uh, no. Uh, I think I got to like season one of Zexel and I dropped it. I was like, this show is not for me, you know? Um. Oh, fuck it. Just go for a game. That game, Leo? So I've only finished. I finished all of GX, finished all of 5Ds, I finished all of. Uh, Arc V. So I guess I've watched half, half, all half. Of all the series, and like I said, I'll give I'll give Reigns a try. I said I, I never finished the original Yu-Gi-Oh. I never did. I know. Well, I actually get more money from dueling Randos than I did from dueling Leo. So, so like I said, we'll run it back by two out of three. Even though that duel was kind of boring, like, like Leo, what the fuck, man? And depending on how long this duel takes, we can go and open up some packs at the card shop, and then hopefully we see some more. uh uh, some more main cast. So, like I said, he'll t he's interested in, what, Crow, Jack, and his sister? So maybe he could tell me where his, um, uh, where they those are, and then they could tell me where Akiza is, and I can go fly with Akiza. You guys already know how this. You know, you guys already know the plan. I want Akiza to be my tag partner so I can have that girl in my arm. Yeah, boy. All right, Leo. So, you gonna go off, or are you just gonna set a monster? Actually, finally, you actually summoned a fucking Mortronic and actually gonna do anything. So, as Tuck is a different turn, you can replay one Machonic in your graveyard to add one Machonic to save one from your deck. But, you don't have any more Machonic in your graveyard unless you play out getting some Machonic. No, you don't. You just play on... <sighs> Leo, for the love of Christ, please tell me you have something. God. And once again, not a lot of monsters. So, Beast King Barbaros. And I'm going to attack. Oh, nope. Nope. Machonic is my you control. I hate some Machonic. All level four high monsters, level four high monsters your opponent controls cannot attack or change spells. Oh, that's why you did it. Okay, that's fine. So, so I cannot attack. All right, sounds good. Sounds good. All right, so of course, with considering heavy storm, I will set the Dustinator to get rid of his whatever it's called, and I'm gonna set the Mirror Force. So if he heavy storms, that means that he would actually go neg. I think I should be good with these two set cards. Yeah. Just to know, just in case he doesn't have a storm, and then I can get rid of this bind, because this card's annoying. Alright. Oh, okay. Oh, wow, this thing has a cutscene? There you go, there's one of the cutscenes you wanted to see. Oh, you got to see from him. Wow. I, what is this card? I've never seen this card before. Once per turn, you can send any number of electronics from your hand to a graveyard. That card game. Alright, sure. 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 Yakok, yeah, this card is all good all of a sudden. <laughs> like, oh, look, look at this hallway. Alright, so, sure. Uh huh. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. Oh, shit, motherfucker. <laughs> damn. He's packing heat. Um, Mirror Force? <laughs> all that dramatic cutscene just to get hit with a Mirror Force. <laughs> Uh, do you have the control of um, a monster? Uh, while you control the face of my monster, blah 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 blah. blah. Alright, you know, just get rid of it. I don't feel like dealing with that card. 
And I get to set a card. Sure. I'll go ahead and set the bottoms. Even though I don't think you're going to do anything else. Uh, nope. I'm just going to go ahead and poke you with Beast King Barbara. So, wow. Like, all that. That cutscene. Why, why is that? Why is that his cutscene? That monster's not even good. Like, it really isn't. Not only is it, maybe if it was, like, stronger base-wise, like, it's 1300. One tribute, and then you gain attack for sending more Patronic monsters. Like, if it was, like, level 4, 1800, maybe we could talk, you know? Because, I mean, you're still going neg with it, but you're going like, super neg. You got a neg on the tribute, and you got a neg to gain the attack. It's just, it's, it's not worth It's not worth it. Yeah, that should be good. So even if you top deck Heavy Storm, once again, we'll even out. Because you'll top your card and your Heavy Storm for two of my cards, so we'll even out. And if not, then hey, then you don't have it. Either way, I'm good. Alright, so that means that I can set up one more back row for your back row. Ah, damn. Sometimes, you know? Like this deck, I draw that. Sometimes I draw all monsters. Sometimes I draw one monster. Ah, well, he gets his effect. So, Gadron. So I one, one more Tronic Spell Trap for Graveyard if I added to him, so you can get your fucking bind back. That's annoying. I believe every monster in my deck is level 4 or higher, so... If you have a face-up more Tronic monster, then I cannot attack, so... Yep, that looks like you're gonna do. So while this card's in attack position, and this card's to show about you can special one level 4 more Tronic monster from your hand. Or Graveyard. Okay. But I'm not gonna be able to destroy you by battle. Go ahead and set that. Yeah, you know, set her face down. Oh, they're coming. Yeah, oh, that's fine. Well. I have Slate Warrior. <laughs> Alright, once again, I can't really do anything with that fucking bind. Shit. I need fucking, uh, what's it called? Oh, I mean, you've come after me, I can Sakuretsu you. It's not terrible. I need, um, nah, he's not even gonna attack, uh, Lila. Can I, oh, right, 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 can't change my battle position, it's like, how come I can't flip up? Can't change your battle position. Right. Right, well, you know what, I'm gonna hold off for now. I'm going to hold off for now. I could Lightning Vortex him. I could. If I get one more monster, then I will probably go ahead and Lightning, lightning Vortex him. Yep, there we go. So you know what? Lightning Vortex. Probably don't need the Shrink. That's gone. You don't control, so I can flip. Yep. Gain 500 attack. So nice whopping 20. And some Kaiku of skin condition. And get it in with all of these monsters, and hopefully that's game. Okay, yeah, and then you're probably gonna attack because right, you control no monsters, and you get the attack is pistol in one, which happens from your hand. Some bitch. Some bitch. Yeah. Wow, you are annoying. You are literally just stalling. Go. So once again, you know, I can't attack. Fucking bind. Like, wow. What's this card do? Oh, uh, well, that's because you can play the- Wow, are you really gonna burn me to death? Huh, you bastard? Ah, uh, you little bitch. You's a little bitch, alright? Hopefully I fucking get Lila soon. Hey, slashing ground. Destroy their face up monster. Destroy the face of monster in the highest defense. Alright. So. Social Growl? Bam! Yeah, buddy! Now watch him have another one of them fucking trap cards. I'll fucking lose my shit. Like, Leo, just die! Die! Hey. I'm not sure if I can end this duel. Um. Uh, sell so upon your threat, and I'm not sure what else is a threat. Yeah, we'll do those two. Alright. So, this is 19. 
I got the clue to my whip chain, so possibly? I'm not doing the math in my head, so. Oh, that's exactly it. I mean, it's 24 left. Tech game? Tech game? GG, Leo? GG? Hey. <laughs> Ah, that was actually annoying. I, you weren't good. You were annoying. Wow, I better get any money from beating you a second time. Like you're not even worth doing, Leo. That we already did it again. I, I beat you two. I said, GG. I'm going on to the next round. All right. So, like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and go to the card shop and buy some. Oh, look, look, look. See, so I got Crow, Jack, and them. So they're telling me that we could probably go ahead and do that next episode. But I think by now it should be nighttime. No, oh, not yet. Not yet. Let's go ahead and buy some cards, and then we'll go ahead and call that an episode. So, do we have anything good? Oh, we got a, a Kizu pack. I don't know why we got a Kizu pack. Like, she's not my tag partner yet. Um. Right, we got the majority of this pack. Yeah, Master of Traps, Master of Spells, Monsters, Ultimate Monsters. Applied traps. Hmm. Hmm. Like I said, this pack, the majority of this pack was Gladiator Beast, and I don't need any more of that. I mean, I could make Glads eventually, but like I said, it's Tari's other one. So, Master of Traps is good, probably, but I already got my one Mirror Force. I'd say Master of Spells, possibly, might be a good choice. Because, I mean, if I can pull some MSTs, I believe MST is at 1 in this game. I don't know. It's Heavy Storm and MST out. Like, MST would be getting some MSTs would be pretty good. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, let's go ahead and grab some, uh, some Applied Monsters. Yeah. Bye. There we go. And, uh, we'll buy some spells. Alright, well, how many can I buy? Uh, can I speed the game? Yeah, I can. Speed up the game, speed up the game, speed up the game. There we go. Alright. So, sweep my money, open all the packs. Alright, what's in here? So, you... Anything good in here? Not really? Uh... This card can only be summoned when put summon. This card's normal summon is destroyed. Okay. No, the card's shit. Card of Curry guy. Uh, there is not anything good in this pack. Not anything good at all. I was looking for some good monsters. What's your thing? It's pretty sad. Oh, for each card in your hand. Yep, yep, yep. Ooh. You sure these are fucking applied monsters? More like fucking shit monsters. So much garbage! This pack is garbage! I got gear for it. It's probably like the best fucking rush hour pool in this pack so far. Wow, wolf. Two wolves, yeah? Hmm. Cause like I said, I could make light thorns, but I like that Minero and then JD and shit. I know JD's on the pack of that fucking ultimate monster, but I'd have to pull him, and I know he's like the, probably the rarest card in that shit, so. Copycat's not terrible. I'm guessing this is the spells, yeah, Master of Spells. Applied monsters more like fucking shady monsters. So what's anything good in applied spells that I pull like MSTs? Fucking pull a Joe friendship and shit. Fucking ass. And I pulled an MST, but it's limited to one in this game. Alright, well now I know, so I'm not getting anything like that. I thought it might be limited to one. So. Eh. Yeah. I mean, I pulled the MST, which is what I wanted to pull. So I got what I wanted. Cannot complain when I was like, hey, I'm gonna go out to the MST, and I got the MST. Got it's limited to one. Old Man's not terrible. That's the GO format right there. Yeah. At MST. I'm guessing that was like a super rare card. Was that like the gold bar? Yeah. Alright. So, did I get, like, the next pack of spells? Yes, I did. Yep, Deluxe Spells. So, now I can buy Deluxe Spells and pull, hopefully pull that, uh, Heavy Storm. Yep, that's what I wanted. So, I'm gonna go ahead and put that MST in the deck. Definitely. Definitely. And, uh, I guess that is it for now. So, 
it was all money and it really wasn't worth it. It really wasn't. So then I guess next episode, if it's not nighttime by the time I leave, we already know where uh, Crow is at, we know where Jack is at, and we know where Luna's at. So I believe Crow, does Crow want to know where Keys is at? I'm not sure. I'm not sure I don't remember, but maybe one of them will tell me where Keys is at. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's play Yu-Gi-Oh! Attack Force 5. So thanks for watching, thanks for the support, I really do appreciate it, and I will see you guys uh, next time we play some Yu-Gi-Oh! Attack Force 5, of course, next Tuesday and Thursday, and of course, uh, more Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's Play during this weekend with some more Legacy of the Duelists. Uh, I said, if we're not wrapping up, like I said, we can buy some more DLC. Um, I'm going, by the time you see this video, I should be gone on a trip to LA, so, um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it, thanks for watching, thanks for the support, really do appreciate it, see you guys next time, thanks for watching.